Hey, what is up, everybody? I'm Star Lord, and today we're going to be doing an awesome glitch that can get you into secret areas on Pokemon Brick Bronze that you wouldn't be able to get to in the normal game. So, you know, like outside of the map, you see those hidden caves that you're not yet allowed to go to because we don't have Surf. Well, now we can actually go and explore what those caves are. It's pretty cool, and what you're seeing on screen right now is that glitch. It is a pre-recorded footage of the glitch, and like you can see, I have just flew right into the sky, straight outside the map. It's very cool, very easy to do. But before we get into the guide, guys, I would like to say, make sure that you subscribe to the channel for more Pokemon Brick Bronze videos, giveaways, and guides when the game is actually updated. So, yeah. Let's get into the guide, guys. Okay, so we're in the game now, guys, and the first thing we need to do is go to Laguna Lake. It's probably the easiest place to do this glitch at. And as you can see, there is an entrance way to another route. This is what we need. We need to be able to enter a building. Now, before we go inside this building, what we need to do is click menu, bag, and walk forward really quickly just as we click bag. And if we do it correctly, you will see you actually go through the door, but your menu is still open. Now what we want to do is don't close it, go back out, and now we need to go to the water. So let's do that. Aim down, click in this area right here, and then do not click old rod, click close. Make sure you do that, guys. And then we just repeat the same process again. Click bag, walk in, and then do it over again. Click out of the actual area, go and fish once again. Now, I'm not gonna, I, I'm, I'm not gonna lie, this is kind of difficult to do when you first start, but once you get it down once or twice, it's pretty easy to do. So, yeah, as you can see, I, I didn't do it right there. So, let's try it again. Okay, no, I didn't do it there either. So, you have to get the timing down just correctly. Click bag and then walk out. So, menu bag, walk in. There you go. Okay, so I, I did it then. Now, that's going to be the last time I'll do this, and I'm going to show you the next part of this glitch. So, now we want to click the water is nice and clear blue. Click close, and now we need to go uh, wherever you want, basically. You can go on water, land, wherever you want to go, just go there. And we must click old rod really quickly, lots of times. And I hope it's working. So, as you can see, I glitched into the water. I am kind of stuck. Oh, there you go. Okay. Okay, so I've made it out now. You, I kind of unglitched, and as you can see, there, I'm done. I'm out of the map, and I'm walking on water with my rod in my hand. This is super awesome. I've never actually been at this part of the map before, so I don't really know uh, what to do. But I know that this is the easiest pl place. I wonder if we can get up there. Right. Okay, so you know the way there's like kind of a cave back here? Yeah, we can actually probably go inside there. I wonder if they've got like Mewtwo or something in there. Oh my god, this will be so cool. Can we get... What's... Wait, what? What? What's going on? You can't go in... It's just like a blank little hallway. What? That's crazy. Oh no. Check over here. Let's see. Okay, so as you can see, you can kind of explore pretty much wherever you want outside the map. So here I am at another city doing the same glitch. I've done it around about seven times now, so I think this is going to be the last time. And this is the uh, area where the beach is. I think you guys know what it's called. I don't really know. It's, it's Ross Cove Beach. That's it. Yeah. So now we're going to try and do the glitch. Hopefully it works because I tried it before and it didn't. Click old rod a couple of times. And there you go. Okay, so we've glitched out of the map once again and yeah this is pretty awesome this is where actually the legendary pokemon jumps into the water maybe we could encounter him or something like that that'd be pretty cool um but now we're outside of the map and we're free to explore hidden so areas. a couple of these guys have been like watching me for a little while now they must be like how did he get over there they're like proper confused hopefully they see this video and are able to do it so I actually explored this little area over here and I found a couple of things. So there is actually a guy over there and a cave right there. I've explored over the other way too, but there wasn't much that we could actually get to. We can't even get inside that cave. 
Um, so yeah, I'm just going to kind of show you guys really quickly uh, that you cannot actually do it. So let's go over to this guy first. I have a feeling that this guy will end up giving you a super rod or a good rod or something like that. You can't get into a player battle with him or anything like that. He's kind of just standing there with a grumpy looking, looking face, I guess. And this cave over here, you cannot actually enter it because uh, you can't get onto the sand, which is very, very sad. Now, in this area of the map, it's actually the first town that you spawn in. I guess, like, it's the pallet town of Pokemon Yellow. And we're here now. I've done it a couple of times. And for some reason, every time I try and do it, I, I try to land in the water. But I actually go flying up into the air. So, let's try it again. I guess I'm going to do it again. I, I feel like I will... Okay, there you go, yeah, so I feel like some places you kind of just fly up into the air and you can't do much about it. That's super cool, by the way, how you can just do that. Um, so what I've gathered is that if you do it in certain places, you have a chance to get on top of buildings and all of that kind of cool stuff. So yeah, I'm outside of the map and... Yeah, I'm kind of confused a little. <laughs> I guess this is the place where people spawn into the game. This is like a spawning area of some sort. Um, but yeah, I'm on top of the moon now. And I'm literally a Star Lord. Um, anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching today's video. I do hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, then please remember to leave a like as it does help me out. And make sure that you go and subscribe to my videos for more Pokemon Brick Bronze. Awesome glitches, guides tutorials, all that kind of cool stuff. Anyway guys, until next time, I've been Star Lord. I'll see ya.